This is gonna like hold your nose, so like it's gonna feel funny, of course. And they're gonna take a hollowed out needle, um, depending on the size of your nose. I have a smaller nose, so it was a smaller needle. And they're gonna push it through your nose, and uh, it's gonna hurt. You're probably gonna squinch up and cry. Um, I didn't cry, but I did have tears in my eyes. I should have filmed this experience uh, video. Oh, shoot! But, uh, sorry, my dog. But, yeah, I probably should have filmed the uh, experience, but I didn't think about it because I kind of been a little absent from YouTube, and I'm sorry. For that, guys, the life's been happening. I'll do a life update video later on in the year. So, anyway, so you have got your, your the needles in it, and he's going to pull it out, and he's going to put the ring in there, and you're going to feel it, like the pressure. And he's going to give you a piece of paper towel, at least this is what mine did, and you're going to put it under your nose because you're going to bleed, and you don't want to, like, push up, but you just want to hold it underneath to catch any blood. And this is going to happen depending on um, how much of a free bleeder you are. If you are a free bleeder, it's probably going to happen longer. Mine happened upwards. I think like an hour and a half. And it was done. So, you, and then for the first couple of days, you're going to have a little bit of swelling. It's going to hurt like a bitch. You're going to want to take ibuprofen. Um, you're going to really make sure that you're cleaning it properly. Again, dial soap. Um, if you choose to do the sea salt soak, remember to use non-iodized sea salt, but that is that is up to you guys. But yeah, so, and the same thing with your cartilages, which I did finally get the hoops. I finally got two of the um, hinge hoops, and I'll do a little tutorial on the hinge hoops and why I prefer them over the twisty ball barbell ones. But yeah, so I have my nose done. Yay! And, um... Like I said, it didn't really hurt me, but again, everybody's pain, ra pain ratio is different. Some people might hurt less, some people might hurt more. It just depends on what your body likes. Um, you want to make sure that you're using, um, like I said, antibacterial soap. Make sure before touching it, you wash your hands. I used hand sanitizer previous to touching my piercing. Um, that's going to be your best friend because you don't want to, like, get germs. And um, if you are, if you do have a cold, I would probably wait till after you um, are all healed up before you go get pierced because your nose contributes to everything that can be wrong with you. So that is my video on my nose ring um, and my nose piercing experience. And I hope you guys find some information up in here. And uh, Chris and I will be starting, or Christopher Lamar will be starting the Poop Squad, our vlog channel. So be sure to check it out. Holla babies.